welcome back to the guy. Okay, I just finished sterilizing my jars, which I boiled them in this really large pot over here. And I used towels to keep the glass from clicking together. So now they're all sterilized. I've washed them first with water and baking soda. And then I boiled them for about 10 minutes and took them out to dry. All right, here are some ingredients you'll need bay leaf, whole cloves of garlic, dill, turmeric, mustard seed, and onions. I'm also going to be using some Himalayan sea salt, white, and also white vinegar and spring water that I'm going to be using for my boiling. Okay, so I'm getting ready to set the Turn the eye on and we're going to go ahead and bring this brine to a boil. This is four cups of spring water and four cups of vinegar, white vinegar in there. We're going to bring this to a boil and we're going to add about a fourth cup of salt. Alright, so here we have our uh, cucumber spears, okay, and then we have the chips over there, okay, so we slice those in chips. All right, and then the spears. So these are pickling cucumbers um, that we're using, okay? And we got them off the vine and they were about, about three to four inches, about four inches or so, um, so they could maintain their, their, their texture and crunch. Um, and they won't get so, um, they won't be full of seeds the bigger they are that but that's what happens okay so now the brine is starting to boil and I'm gonna go ahead and pour in my salt okay that's a fourth a cup of salt sea salt I'm gonna let that penetrate in there and we're gonna keep our um, brine boiling while we prep the jars the drying towel here waiting for my glass jars to come out of the oven and here are the cucumbers we have the chips and we have the spears all right the chips and the spears all right so now we just take the jars out of the oven place them here on the towel okay our glasses are ready to come out of the oven now so i'm gonna go ahead and take them out They've been in there for about 10 minutes, so we're going to take them out and go ahead and fill the jars with the um, spices and veggies. So we're going to go ahead and fill the jars with our different herbs and spices. So I'm going to drop in bay leaf in each jar. In this one I'll put um, two. So that's the garlic. Give it some flavor, not too much. Good. Put some, put some more. Good. Put some in the other jar. Y'all don't hardly have any in that one. Good.
turn to the side to get it to fit in there. To that little rim right here Isaiah no further than that and then we have to pack it down okay. <laughs> don't feel any more than that we're gonna pack it in there right there all right right there hold on we gotta immediately put the lid on When your jars are sealed, when you push down on the lid, there'll be no popping sound. But if they, if the lids pop when you push down on the lid, then your jars are not sealed. One trick that I'll do is I'll make sure that my lids are warm before I place them on top of my jar. Or I'll just immer immerse the jar down into some warm water and let the entire jar get warm very quickly. Pull it out and then my jars will seal. Our beautiful pickles are done. We did get sealed jars. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer for other jars to seal. And they were absolutely delicious. No preservatives, no artificial flavors, no artificial colors. The turmeric will give you that yellowy color that you like in your pickles. And you know what? No preservatives. Oh, none GMO. It is all organic, delicious pickles. So like this video if you like it, and we hope you do. Subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>